Hello, this is my new uh, modern everyday folder. Uh, it's based on a friction folder, which is an old style of knife. Um, has no actual lock. However, this one I've incorporated a removable locking system. Um, so hopefully this should also classify as an everyday carry legal um, article under section 139. It has what I call a grenade lock. This is a little detent pin. Um, and it sits in this holder here. Take it out, we now have a normal friction folder. The blade just swings open and closed. You can put your thumb on a small tang at the back, and in this grip, it's fairly secure. You're unlikely to fold it without realizing it. And again, if you're cutting properly, you should be trying to close the blade. It actually has a slight friction lock as it does come up um, which does hold it reasonably secure although it's not going to stop it being bashed open so as is, as is uh, sub 3 inch blade or cutting edge um, no locking mechanism everyday legal carry however um, as you can see I haven't quite adjusted the friction lock yet I don't think it needs a little bit tighter and maybe a little uh, lock tight on there to stop it from coming. That's not that particularly safe in the pocket. Um, but if you tighten it up too much, it's a bit of a pain to open. So to overcome this, as I said, we have this item, which if you can see, the hole in the blade lines up when it's closed with the hole in the handle, the detent pin push it through and now there's absolutely no way that you can open this knife okay so it's perfectly safe in the pocket um, you're not going to get the edge so to use it pull the grenade pin open the knife the hook on the um, the hook on the bottle opener swings round and that becomes the second locking position way you're going to fold that. We've got a quarter inch hardened steel pivot pin, a 4mm um, stop pin and now we've got a 5mm stainless steel locking pin. Those three hold the blade solid and now you've pretty much basically got a good solid folder turned into a fixed blade. Okay so again pull the pin, hold it up, replace the pin. Now it is a bit fiddly and yes you've got a something small that's separate that you can lose but unfortunately that's what happens when you have laws like ours. Okay. Okay, next feature. We have a hex key in here and a couple of cutouts in the liners and handles. This is designed to take a standard hex drive. Here I've got a hex drive with a notch, a magnetic holder for bits. So if we open it up slightly, the hex key can now he says push all the way through so the notch comes out, close the the blade fully and one of the liners then locks into the notch. We can replace the detent key uh, pin and that is now in there solid and you can put any bits you want in there at all. It will also obviously fit the standard notched 50mm bits. Also if you're in a hurry or just want it quickly using this or even the little standard bits they will just push in there and you can use it as a turner um, although obviously it's not locked in. Another feature on the knife is the bottle opener. Hold it in the uh, fist grip, front or back, doesn't matter. Gauge the bottle cap, straight off.